being lost has to be one of the worst feelings in the world. The only thing that's worse than being lost is being lost and, and being late at the same time. That's the worst combination. And you're probably thinking, yo, Skills, where did you get that sexy Maserati from? Where did you get that car? Well, I borrowed it from a friend. Because I had to hurry up and pick up my passport. And I don't know where this place is. I think it's right here on the right. Yeah, there it is. There's the building. But I'm going to pick up my passport. I got somewhere special to be. And I like this car. I might buy one of those. Maybe. Who knows? But let me quickly show you the gear I'm going to be wearing in the next upcoming matches. I'm wearing the white Adidas. I bought those out the EA store. I'm going to be going with second wind. I took giant throw off and put on second wind. And as you can see, I'm wearing the red gloves. White Adidas and the long socks or the high socks and it's Euro time baby it's time for the Euro Let's quickly go over the groups group A Netherlands Italy Greece Slovenia group B Spain Czech Republic Sweden and Austria group C will be France Germany Hungary and Scotland and in the final group group D Portugal England North Ireland and Russia, haha, <laughs> Portugal v England will be epic. We look at the lineups real quick. As you can see, it's on legendary as well. Five minute halves. Cristiano Ronaldo skills in the front. João Moutinho holding down the midfield. Fabio Contron in the back. And Roy Patricio playing goal. And this kind of made me upset. First of all, it is 2016. So, um, Nan Nani's on the team, but players like Pep, Roy Morels, they're gone, man. They must have retired. They must be over already. Their careers must be done. So the lineups are very, very, very different. A lot of the, the big boys in, from England, a lot of the big boys from Portugal would have retired. So it's really different teams. But one thing that kind of made me a bit upset as we start the game off here in the 12th minute, I'm going to call for the ball and check out this play, right? I'm going to use a fake shot. But look at skills getting fancy, trying to pull off a lucky charm, trying to taste the rainbow. But I messed it up. <laughs> I should have just scored the goal. But uh, what makes me mad, right? What makes me a bit upset is EA needs to introduce a feature where you can recommend things to the manager. For example, Nani's on the bench because he's a left mid in this game. But Nani could play uh, left wing, left mid, right mid, right wing. And instead of him playing the right wing, he's benched. And, and Ronaldo obviously is going to play the left wing. But he should be playing on the right wing and he's not. There's a lot of things I wish I could recommend to this manager, and I can't, and I find that to be BS. But as you can see, 74 minutes into the game, it's still nil-nil. I thought we would walk over North Ireland. I, was, I swear I thought we were going to dominate them, but they were creating as many chances as us. 79th minute, you see the second half is all North Ireland. A beautiful shot. I thought they would take the lead, but some great defending there from Portugal. And in the 88th minute, the game was still nil-nil. I tried to put the team on my back the entire game, and I couldn't. But here, look at that. I don't know if I'm offside or not, but the ref keeps the flag down, so I smash it! Booyah! <laughs> my first goal in the Euro, the 90th minute skills. Look at the Portuguese dancing. That's three points in the bag. Skills puts the team on his back. It's a lovely thing. Portuguese fans must be excited. I really want to win the Euro. I really want to show up on the national stage as you can see we win it 1-0 unlucky to north ireland because they played a beautiful game well i got an 8.8 .8 match rate and i got the the only goal of the game and as you can see we had four shots two on target north ireland had four shots zero on target but possession was the same and look at this i get benched after putting the team on my back i get benched and this is something i hope ea changes in the upcoming fifas man because i'm an 84 overall i know i have a higher overall than nelson Oliveira. I'm not tired. I only played one game, and the, the next game was like four days away. I should clearly be able to play. Look, Cristiano Ronaldo plays every single game, but I just hope he doesn't keep continue to do this because if he does and we make it further in the competition, I'm not going to be able to play in like the semis and stuff. That would suck, man. But as you can see, we knock off Russia, which gives us six points. I can confirm to you guys right now that England is on six points, which means the final game is just to see who determines who wins first place. That's all it's going to determine. But hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, a like as always. Appreciate Subscribe if you enjoyed that content. Tomorrow's episode, we're going to be playing England. And I also, I'm going to show you guys what I got. I got a present for being the top goal scorer in the BPL. Find out what it is in the next episode. I'm out of here. That's a booyah.